of the talk, Greg, leading up to this one has been about the impact of the backcourt. And that's where it all starts. When you have a confident and competent backcourt, it just opens up a lot of things for you offensively. And now the Lakers starting group. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. Austin Reeves out there with James. And it's Connect in at the three, the small four. Now, here's Kevin Kumbo. I don't know that anyone covers as much ground in one or two strides as Giannis. On the wing, James. Here's Reeves. Lopez with the block. Here's Middleton. The kick out to Lopez. And a miss there on the triple. LeBron against Trent. On the wing, Reeves. James looking around. And the layup falls. Like at this point in time, like you have to understand that if LeBron James is on the inside, he has so many ways to beat you. A little contact's not going to do anything. Now, here's Lillard. Last game we saw him score 13. Giannis on the follow. Andre Dekumbo has got his second bucket of the game to go. I love the determination he showed there, getting himself into good position under the glass. With the presence of mind to know just where the rebound was going to come down. Well timed. LeBron's shot is good. And one of those players who will not be denied. LeBron so strong inside. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Well, Kevin, Doc Rivers gave me a few minutes to catch up with him. He told me, now that team goes as Anthony Davis goes. When AD is good and he's in rhythm, everything clicks. Coach said we'll need a team effort at both ends. Our communication has to be excellent, and even then, we're not going to completely stop him. Guys? Thanks, David. And here's Trent following the three-pointer by Anthony Davis. Trent passes to Middleton. Pass to Lillard. Let's it go with a three. Sinks the triple. How about dueling from long range, just going at each other. Take that, he says. I see your three, and I'll raise you another three. Now here's James. He's a good contributor to his team, averaging about 10 and a half points a game. Davis against Lopez. Misses off the left eye. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. I'm sure they'll think twice about shooting against him next time. Alert against James. Misses the three. And so it's Davis. He'll bring the ball up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Arguably one of the best bigs of his generation, Anthony Davis. I know you admire his game. Well, he takes over the game on both ends of the floor. You would look at a Tim Duncan, a Kevin Garnett, a guy that can beat you with five blocks, or a guy that can dominate the post and score 25 a night. James gets the bucket. No doubt James can be effective right off the catch if he's gotten himself properly set up. It's Trent on the wing. And stolen by Lillard. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. Low block shot. LeBron with the block. Oh, look at the old man still getting it done on defense. LeBron James still takes great pride in rejecting shots. And the replay demonstrating once again how aggressive that defense was. And an early swat like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. And the Bucks with possession here. They trail by three. And Middleton kicks to Lopez. Lock it two. He's now one for two with that bucket. I tell you what, it's, it's almost like stealing to watch how he plays the game from this seat. Outside, James. And stolen by Lillard. Here's Antetokounmpo. And the dunk by Giannis. Making it look simple. The athleticism of Giannis on full display. James, the pass to James. 
They grabbed their own miss. Davis. Good D by Lopez. Look, the defense was locked in on him there. They know how dangerous he can be, and they guarded him perfectly. Lillard, the pass to on the Kumbo. Takes it down to Middleton. Good. And it's Giannis picking up the assist. And this is what Middleton does. It trades. He's one of the best in the league at helping his team. Just five on the clock. Portis a screen on Reed. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Trent's got a couple of three-pointers in the second for Milwaukee. Lakers trail by three. Here's James. Three-pointer. And LeBron gets it to go with the assist by James. LeBron's got seven points for the quarter. And Doc Rivers has called a timeout. Looking for a breather. And maybe just one or two things to talk James against Lillard. Prince with a screen on James. Lillard fires away from way outside. And again, the Bucks miss. Los Angeles has gotten into trouble with the three ball in the second quarter. Only hitting one of five attempts. And it's slammed in by Davis. Throw it high and watch Davis fly. Wow. The Bucks trail. Lillard outside. To the wing right side. There's the lob. And the There's Giannis. Look out below. Richard, we've seen how far basketball has evolved from 10 years ago to five years ago to now. What is it looking like when you go ahead five or 10 years? I think in five to 10 years, we're going to see more and more centers that are just so skilled. Taller players, more Kevin Durant's. You're going to see more Wimby's. You're going to see more Chet Holmgren's because they're not just putting the tall guy underneath the basket. They're giving him the ball and teaching him how to run pick and roll now. And Davis throws it down. This is the defensive intensity you have to have against Davis inside, but he still powers through it. Outside, out of the combo. Good. Great play by Lillard to set it up. Lillard's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Pass to connect. Down low. Here's Davis. Oh, Davis down low. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. Lillard against James. Portis sets the pick for Lillard. Good! Another from three. And that last three now ties him for the franchise record for most in a season. You know he's looking for that next one. You talk about being locked in all year long. Next one sets the franchise record. What a season it's been for him. A premier player in this league. Davis with another huge night showing why he is an NBA champion. Lillard, the pass to Portis. 116 left to play in the first half. And so onto the Kumbo looking over it. Just four to shoot. And there's the block. Just stops it cold and takes possession. Uh, more good work on the glass there. When it's all said and done, I think rebounding might tell the story in this game. Portis is screen on Hachimura. Trent with the wide open look. No good on the three. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. Pass to Reeves. Hachimura with it. Here's Connect. Here's the three. Antetokounmpo pulls it in. And he continues to cast away. But the results just haven't been there tonight. And the basket is good. Andre DeCumbo's got 16 points. Uh, he's been locked all the way in from the floor. And he's the number one reason why they're winning right now. Alert against James. Pass to Davis. And stolen by Portis. Loads it up for Giannis. And the slam dunk by Hunter Tacumbo. And how about the incredible timing on that alley-oop? He absolutely hammered it down. 
Giannis Antetokounmpo, he's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for Milwaukee. He finishes with nine points in the quarter. The D is having all sorts of problems with them. And now we'll see. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. You know, Davis has been exceptional here, guys. Yeah, pretty much all throughout that first half. And he was taking care of his business on the low blocks and getting more than his fair share of dunks. He has been aggressive, getting into the painted area seemingly at will and wreaking absolute havoc on the defense. Taking a look at Los Angeles. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. James is out there with Austin Reed. And it's Connect in at the small four. Trent can't hit. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. LeBron outside. And it's Connect in the corner. And that'll be Milwaukee as it goes out of bounds. Bucks retain possession. Milwaukee leading by four. Trent outside. Pass to Lillard. Over James. A tad short, but it's good off the front iron. Lillard's got ten points. Aggressive move by Lillard, attacking the heart of that defense. Hey, GA, how about Damian Lillard's time in Portland? 11 magnificent years. I mean, Kevin, arguably the best trailblazer of all time. Rookie of the year, then seven all-star appearances. Dane will always be a legend in the Rose City. Up again, it's good on the putback. And the Bucks lead by five. And, folks, he did not luck into that one. He knew just where he wanted to be to grab that backboard. Third quarter here, over a minute and a half into it. Oh, AD through contact. Uh-oh, everything is going AD's way. He is in that zone and scoring at a terrific pace. Trent against Reeves. Middleton right side. Rebounded by the Lakers. And they're winning, but it hasn't been because of him. He can't throw it in the ocean so far. LeBron with it. Now guarded by Middleton. Reeves with the screen for Connect. Driving in. And the rebound goes to Lopez. Lopez has got four rebounds now tonight. Nothing just seems to be bouncing his way today. Mama said there'd be days like this. They have missed his production. Middleton looking it over. A shot by Lillard wide open from outside off the mark. Well, despite some uneven shooting from him, they're still out in front. Here's Connect. Trills the baseline jumper. Connect's got five points now in the quarter. Some old school basketball from young Dalton Connect there using the mid range. Trent kicks to Giannis. And it's Lopez at the elbow. Three pointer Miller connects again from distance. And he shattered the franchise single season high for three pointers made. Getting them up and connecting with high volume. He's been a flamethrower all season long. And James throws it down. Chemistry at its best. An unreal alley -oop. Yeah, though, you're right. And all those points off turnovers have been a huge bonus. I mean, that aggressive defense has also paid dividends at the offensive end of the floor. Back to Lillard. They get it back. Misses the baby hook. And so James will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. A two-point game. Following this game, they hit the road to challenge the Nuggets at Ball Arena in Denver. That's game four of four out on the road for Davis on the follow. And that is where Davis hurts you the most around the hoop. Milwaukee's gone one of two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Lillard against James. Lillard scanning the floor over James. 
and it's Lillard again missing. His consistency just hasn't been there this quarter in terms of his shooting. Davis, the pass to LeBron. Over Lopez. And LeBron with the basket, the assist by Davis. LeBron's got 16 points. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Three-pointer, Lillard. Again, the miss by Lillard. The Lakers in the lead. James finds James. James, a screen on Lopez. Fires away from outside. James gets the bucket. James has got five points now in the quarter. Look, when LeBron James is hitting his three from that spot, look, this offense completely opens up. Lillard, the pass to Trent, and out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession of the ball. As we approach the playoffs, let's see how the East is shaping up. You take a look at the Bucks. They're trying to get in the playoffs here. If they send here is Los Angeles now. James kicks to LeBron. High post, Davis. Back to James to end the cold streak. That's in there. Davis with the assist. LeBron's got 16 here in the second half. Just zero hesitation from James, trusting his shot. Miller against James. It's out of the combo on the wing. And James pulls it down. LeBron's. Reeves finds Davis, and Davis throws it down hard. Davis wants the ball in these big moments, and his ability to deliver is what makes him a special player. Trent against Reeves. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. First personal foul. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for Los Angeles. Oh, they've been punishing the inside defense consistently in this one. Look, it's been a very productive area of the floor for them. And on top of that, they've really been dialed in from deep, just dropping triple after triple. Hey, Lillard has all the talent in the world, but, man, this guy is a great leader. Lots of charisma, and he holds his teammates accountable. And so he hits both. Now he's perfectly comfortable doing work at the line. And J.J. Redick is called timeout. He has decided it's the right time to talk. Los Angeles has gotten just one of four three-pointers to go down for them here in the fourth. Reeves the pass to Davis. Back to Reeves. And that one is off. Good work defensively by Trent. Lillard. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Proof positive that Lillard is worthy. That's talent you can build a franchise around. LeBron outside. James a screen on him. Nakumbo. And here's Reeves outside. Rebound Milwaukee. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. And the rejection by James. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. Ball. Smart anchor at passes, Greg, are really paying off for them at the moment. And also good off-ball movement. Everyone is paying attention and looking to create the best shot for the team. And Middleton gets the honest. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That one on Davis. Maybe the most highly skilled big man in our league. Giannis is also one of the most frequently fouled bigs in our game. First free throw is good, and that gives them the lead. And he hits 
both free throws here. So now it's a two-point ball game. And really, the tension could not be higher right now. And he looked like he was shooting free throws at practice. What a cool customer. And the rejection by Giannis. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And in a close game, blocks like that are so clutch. And that could be a real difference maker here tonight. One thirty-six left in the fourth quarter. Leaves the pass to LeBron. I think everybody knows how good LeBron James is. But the thing that makes it remarkable is the longevity of his talent. And he is still leading the way for his team. He hits the first one, and that narrows the gap to one. Good for James. And this is how you execute. Creating any type of separation is huge right now. Pass to Antetokounmpo. And it's LeBron James with the rebound. LeBron's got 15 rebounds here tonight. And Davis throws it down hard. And that's what you call a big-time shot by a big-time player. AD demonstrating just how clutch he really is. Well, I'll tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. And he cannot get the first one to drop. Tough one to miss. I think what makes Giannis special is how uncomplicated he is. The man is just an incredible, pure athlete who simply loves the game of basketball. That's all there is to it. And he ends up making the second, and that narrows the gap to one. And what I love about Giannis, yeah, he's a superstar, an MVP, a champion. But best of all, Giannis is an incredible ambassador for the game. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. He knew what... 52 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And to the Kumbo inside. James defending. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And how about the attack there from Giannis inside? Going right into the defense and still able to get the shot up. Gets the first, and that brings them within two. good as he hits both of his shots. The game has come down to this. Huge possession. Into Nakumbo against LeBron. Davis with a screen on Nakumbo. This one for three. Trifecta! Some players shrink when the pressure's on, but he lives for these moments. And Doc Rivers has called a timeout. And he knows there's no room for mistakes. And what? We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Adedekumbo finds Lillard. Lopez left side. For three, Middleton. Money! And that shot brings them to within just one. A quality pass setting up a quality shot. It's just textbook basketball. So they foul intentionally. And you know what? Smart foul. You got to try and extend the game.
He drops the first one, and that will put them up by two. So he goes two for two at the one, and it's a three-point game. Yeah, those free throws make things a little more simpler right now. They just have to guard against the three-point. And so it's the Lakers who come out on top here. This win, such a tremendous emotional boost for them. Yeah, really an accomplishment and, and crazy finish to take a road game like this and simply deflate an entire building.